the all new 2023 model, Mercedes Brabus GLS 800 Maybach. And they are massive. I love the sound. As soon as you open the door again, they pop out the gorgeous interior of this GLS 800. This being one of the most luxurious SUVs. I really like it. Hello guys, I am back today welcoming you all with this. Right in front of us we have a GLS 600 Maybach, but as you can already see, it's not a normal one. Right in front of us we have the all new 2023 model, Mercedes Brabus GLS 800 Maybach. And in today's video I want to give you a full tour of the exterior, afterwards we'll check out the inside and then last but not least we will be listening to the Brabus sound. So first things first, we are right here at Holman International at the showroom guys. They have everything you can imagine and you can dream of. SL63, S680 Maybach, a lot of GLSs, Gs, Rolls Royce. They even have a 6x6, 4x4, G63 800, another GLS 800, a lot of cars. But we will be mainly focusing on this. This is also for sale, so if you are interested in getting it, hit them up, they are ready to help you. Let me just get it on. Base for this vehicle is the GLS 600. Maybach. So we have a V8 by turbo. It's actually the exact same engine they have with the AMGs, the 4 liter V8, but we don't have that much of performance. I think we are talking about 500 and something horsepower as a base. But with this one being a Brabus, we have a full conversion, exterior parts, wheels, and performance, making this an 800 horsepower beast. They've put bigger turbos and now this is an absolute machine. Uh, we have the Brabus look, exterior paint. I think it's hyacinth red with this Maybach GLS. And then we have a lot of Brabus parts. So let's start with the tour and let me show you through. First things first, Brabus double B here on the front bonnet. Then in addition to that, we have the Maybach specific grille, but also changed by Brabus, full finished in black gloss also with the Maybach initials. The headlights are still the same. Even though we have a facelifted version, it's still the same. The front bumper here is made by Brabus to make it look even sportier and still very classy. You have these intakes here, full finished in carbon fiber. And then in addition to that, we have another front lip here finished in a black gloss with an additional led light making this gls by brabos an absolute monster i really love the additional lights and front lip finished in carbon fiber and i think it's just perfect would you rather go for a stock gls maybach or with the brabos version please share it in the comment section below talking about the side size wise there have been no changes when you compare the gls maybach with the base gls we just have more space in the back seats giving us less trunk space no seven seater with this only being a four seater anyways talking about the side there's also something that i have to show you and it's the wheels these are my all-time favorite wheels i love them so so much monoblock wheels are just love pure love and they are massive i love the sound 24 inches the biggest wheel size you can go uh, on this uh, gls and also on all brabus models it's literally the max on the side we have the step board as i have the door open still in the back you have the step board looking out but as soon as you just push the door a bit you will realize we have soft closing doors and then we have the step boards running back in. There we go. As soon as you open the door again, they pop out. And also with the Maybach initials, I really like these a lot. Bye bye. So in the rear, we're talking again 24 inches monoblocks and these are finished in shadow chrome, not in black or not in chrome. We have a nice chrome finish on these called shadow chrome by brabos massive lovely these are the monoblock amps on the c pillar we have the maybach badge here full finished in black gloss and everything apart from that we have no chrome at all full finished in black gloss also the door handles normally these are also in chrome anyways now it's time to focus on the rear 
And here we have it. We are sitting right behind the GLS 800 by Brabos. And we have a lot of changes when talking about the rear. First things first, I have to say the proportions, the overall look is just so nice. We have a facelift coming right now, but the only change coming with the tail lights I've showed you in my previous videos. We still have the pre facelift. GLS tail lights here. Normally we would have a chrome bar here. It's full finished in black gloss. 800 badge finished in black. Bravos double B as well. Bravos badge here again. Full black gloss. And you can also go with a Bravos additional spoiler here on the top. We have that on another vehicle here at Holman, which I will be showing you later on. The exhaust is the Bravos Maybach GLS specific one. Looks really big and it's actually humongous, but it looks cool on this car giving this still a classy and nice touch because we are still talking about the Maybach and it's not that loud but it has a very nice tone the sound engineering is just amazing on this carbon fiber also here on the rear diffuser and also a lot more black additional parts to give this the final touch all in all how do you guys like the rear of this one let me just show you the other version so here's the other version of the GLS Maybach by Brabos and here we have the additional rear spoiler you can see that here on top uh, oh, the view is just stunning. Just look at a V12 two-tone Maybach. Wow. BBX, extended wheelbase Bentayga, Cullinan. Oh, just look at these. Continental GTCs, both in the exact same spec. Wow. <laughs> Anyways, how do you guys like it? Would you rather go for the red one or with the black spec as we have it here? Please choose in the comment section below. Let's get back to our car. Back here with our GLS 800 by Brabos. Let's just jump inside and let me show you the interior. Opening the door, step board. <laughs> it's so cool, I loved it. And checking out the gorgeous interior of this GLS 800. So now it's time to talk about the interior, but as you can already hear, I'm getting distracted by other cars. When I'm just trying to focus on the Novitec Estesto Urus, I see an SL63, the S680 Maybach, and one of my all-time favorite cars, the GT900 Rocket. Wow. Uh, let's focus on our car again. Talking about the inside, we have no changes coming from Brabos. The only changes coming with the floor mats by Brabos, the entrance board by Brabos. That's actually it. Also, the gas and brake pedals are by Brabos. And apart from that, we have no changes by Brabos. This being still a full Mercedes Maybach interior conversion. Let me just jump inside and give you a full tour. Look, we have some noises from the outside as soon as I close the door. So in the inside now, it's super, super comfortable. There's no noises coming at all. Uh, we have a nice interior finish, but this coming from Mercedes-Benz. So we have a nice brown, dark red finish on the leather here. On top and on the bottom, we have the Macchiato Beige, also here on the steering wheel. We also have a change of the steering wheel now with the GLS Maybach. This is still the previous one, which I didn't really like back in the days. The new one I, I like. Full finish Macchiato Beige, even the airbag cover finished in beige. I really love that. We have the wooden trim in the inside of this Maybach, also here with the Maybach initials. Apart from that, we also have the Maybach theme here. We also have a Maybach driving mode. Oh wait. We have the Maybach, Maybach driving mode. There we go. And with the Maybach driving mode and the curve mode, we also have the get free mode with the off-road driving, which means that this car can also bounce. So cool. In the rear, we have the first class font, only two-seater because they are separated here in the center. We have the fridge, the Maybach emblem over there. We have the ambient colors and the leather work surrounding the rear passengers like a cocoon. We have a lot of sound isolation also here in the back, finished in wooden trim, really cool. Uh, you can actually put this seat uh, right to the front, so you have way more space there. We have the Maybach pillows here, finished in the exact same configuration style. This here, ah, you open it by yourself. You can put the Maybach glasses, your drinks, whatever. You also have the displays and you can control them with the tablet right over there. We have a lot of light in the inside coming from the panoramic sunroof. And in addition to that, we also have the ambient colors there on top. Uh, surrounding us, we also have the surround sound system by Burmester, which are also illuminated here all over the car. I really love that. In the inside here, ambient colors all over around. And this being one of the most luxurious SUVs. I really like it. And now guys, I have a question for you. Would you rather go for this Mercedes Maybach GLS or would you go for a 
Bentley, Bentayga or for a Rolls Royce Cullinan, which is just right over there. What would you guys choose? I mean, just talking about the price, this is actually the cheapest. So I would definitely go for this one. But now let's get on and let's start with the sound. So now let's get on. I will be putting the window down for you. Sound isolation again with the double glasses. I mean, it's a Brabus, but the sound is not too loud. Still a nice Maybach sound. Three, two, one, starting it up. Mm, nice. And I think if you go to the sport mode, because a bit louder, if I'm not mistaken, uh, it also lowers itself. Really cool. So now listen to the sound of this. I love the sound, I really like it. It's really good. We don't have a lot of pops and bangs because this still being a Maybach has to be very classy. So this is just the best. Really, really great sound engineering done by Brabos. Now let's just jump outside and also listen to the sound from the outside. So now it's actually time to listen up to the sound of this GLS 800 by Brabos with the step board running in. Three, two, one, let's get it on. I really like the sound. How do you guys like the sound? Rate the sound from 1 to 10 in the comment section below. So that's it basically for today's video, guys. How do you like this GLS 800 by Brabos here at Holman International? If you guys are interested in buying this car, just hit them up. I have all the information in the description below. As you can already hear again, I'm getting distracted. Therefore, I'm finishing the video right here. If you want to watch more of the GLS 800, please share it in the comment section below. Already looking forward to see you all again and wish you an amazing day. I will be back.